Hello everybody, my name is FlyingCow1 and welcome to today's video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to build this large modern mansion that you can see right behind me here. Now this mansion does feature a four car garage and it is two stories tall, so go ahead and stick around till the end of the video if you want to see how to make it. And let's get right into the build. So now the blocks that we're going to be using are all right here on the screen, so go ahead and pause the video right now if you're going to be building along with me and go collect all those blocks. And then let's get right into the build over here guys i already got the layout here you can just ignore it but so first what we're going to do is take our white concrete we're just going to place down one block right there go over three place another and then go over another three and place another and that's going to be the top right corner of a square and then off of that square we're going to place one more go away two and then place one more now we're going to take our acacia planks we're going to place three go over three place another three Go over two from that and place one. And then we're gonna take our light gray concrete and place two right there. And then we're gonna place two right there. Now from here, we're gonna go back to the square that we placed. We're gonna place another acacia plank, go over two, place another, over two, and then over two again. And then we're gonna go ahead and just copy down that part over here inversely. Oops. So this house is completely symmetrical, so if you know how to build one part of it, then you know how to build all of it, because it's the exact same side if you cut it in half. <clears throat> okay, so now that we have that, we're going to go ahead and go back over here, and we're going to take our light gray concrete, we're going to place down seven. Now we're going to place down four and on this little corner right here what we're going to do we're going to take our spruce planks and we're going to just cover that corner and it's going to go three down on each side and then we're going to take our white concrete we're going to place down two right there an acacia plank place down one go over two place down two more go over two place down two more and then go over two and place down one and then we just go ahead and copy down the exact same thing onto this side right here all right now that we have that part done what we're going to go ahead and do is build these garages right here so to do that, I'm just going to build this one and I'm going to explain how I do it and then I'm going to go over to the other side and just build that one since it's the exact same. So we're going to just fill in this floor right here with jungle wood planks. You're going to want to dig it out. I already have it dug out just to save some time on the video. And then once we have that all dug out, we're going to take the acacia planks. We're going to go up two on all of these blocks right here. Then we're going to take our light gray concrete, we're going to build up three, and then we're going to drag it over, it's going to go all the way out and it's going to extend by two blocks. Then we can take our white concrete, we're going to build up two on each of those. We can go ahead and connect this little doorway right there. And then we're going to take our scion stained glass panes. We're going to fill in this little window right here. And then we can go ahead and fill in this window as well. Let's actually take our light gray concrete and cover up this. All right, so it's going to be just like that. And then we'll let's go ahead and just fill in this window. Right there. And then we can take our light gray concrete again. We're going to build it over until it meets this square, which we can build up right there. And then the final step of this of these walls is taking our pillar quartz block. We're going to place them sideways right here so that it resembles a garage door. And 
We're gonna cover up this area right here with our light gray concrete. And then we're gonna place down two stone buttons right there to make garage doors, uh, little handles right there. Now for the roof section of this part, what we're gonna do is we're gonna build, let's see here, yeah. So we're gonna build white concrete around all of it. And we're gonna have a line right in the middle right there. So this is supposed to, okay. So we're gonna have it like this. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our white concrete, we're gonna place it in each of the corners right there. And then right here, we're going to cover that area with white concrete. And we're gonna put glass in between all of these. And now right here, we can go ahead and just add another layer onto this square. And then do that same thing by placing them in the corners and then putting the black stained glass panes in between. And then from that, what we're going to do, we're going to take our spruce wooden slabs and we're going to build over all of that. It's going to extend out by one block. And let's go ahead and fill that in. And then we can go ahead and do that same thing on this lower little roof level right here. Except on the lower roof, it's going to go up. It's going to extend out only in the front right there. So once we have that down, we can go ahead and just do that exact same thing over here on this side. Now I don't really need to explain it now because it's just the exact same thing. So if you want to skip this part, then you can.
All right, so now that we've got that part down and matching, what we're going to do is we're going to take our acacia planks again. We're going to build up two on each of these ones right here. Then we're going to take our white concrete and we're going to build over all of that. And it's going to extend out by one block. So there we have that right there. We're going to take our jungle planks again we can go ahead and just fill those all in and these two windows saying windows spaces uh, can't speak right there on the side we're going to fill those in with our black stained glass panes we're going to leave the middle one open and that's going to be our front doorway and then while we're at that let's go ahead and fill in these corners right here since we are now moving on to the corners of the house, or of the mansion. So let's fill in that corner, and then we're going to take our light gray concrete, and we're going to build around where this corner is, and we're going to create a 2x4 window right there. And we can go ahead and fill that in with our black stained glass panes. And then on this side, we're going to have a little one by one window. Now let's build up on these two blocks right here with our white concrete. And now let's just go ahead and go copy that part down to this other side right here. Shouldn't take too long. And then on these spruce planks, the part that I almost forgot, we're, gonna just, we're just going to build up two on them. Or one block higher, it's going to be two blocks high total. Now let's go fill in the floor on this part right here. Again, we're going to be using our jungle planks. Alright, and now I think it's time that we light this place up a little, especially in these garages right here. We're just going to take our lanterns, we're going to hang them on these beams right there. Hang one right there too. Let's go light up the other one. So a lantern right there. And now for this middle section of the house, let's go ahead and fill in the floor right here. What we're going to do is we're going to build a big square in the middle we're going to leave it open and then we're going to fill it in with our spruce planks since we have the square like that we can go ahead and just fill it in with spruce kind of change the floor up a little bit give it a little more of a pattern Alright, now that we have that, we can go ahead and take our white concrete again. Let's build up on this 
side of the wall right there. Taking, we're gonna take our acacia planks, we're gonna build up two on each of these. And then we're gonna take our white concrete, and we're just gonna build over all of those right there. And then right here, we're going to fill this part in with white concrete right there, so it looks like that. And then we can go ahead and fill in these with our cyan stained glass panes. Alright, now that we've got that first floor down, what we're going to want to do is we're going to take where is it? Oh, there they are. We're going to take our cobblestone stairs. We're just going to place them right there and then place an upside down one, right side up, upside down until we get to the second level. So there we are. There's the second level right there. And now what we're going to want to do is we're going to take our white concrete. We're going to build across on those. Make sure you get both sides there. Then we're going to take our acacia planks. We're going to place one down right there. Then we're going to place another one down right there. One down right there. And one down right there. So you're going to need to break some blocks to place those. And then what we're going to do is we're going to place our jungle planks underneath all of that. actually line this whole second floor up with the jungle planks and then we're gonna take our white concrete we're gonna place it all the way around all of that except when it gets to right here we're gonna have it extend out a little it's going to go back so there we go. It's going to look just like that now. Now what we can do, we can go ahead and fill in this floor right here. It shouldn't take too long. And we are filling this all in with our jungle planks again. And once we have that, we've got one more layer here. And we can go ahead and start working on the walls of the front part of this build. So right here, we're gonna take our white concrete again. We're gonna build up two extra layers. And then we're gonna build right here. We're gonna go over all the way down, connect it right there. And we're gonna put two more layers right there. Let's go ahead and do that exact same thing over here. And then once we have that, we can take our acacia planks. We're going to build up two on each of these. And then we can take our white concrete. We're going to build over all of this right here. And it's going to extend out two layers. So that's how it will look now. Let's actually break this part just because of the little shadow glitch right there. I don't really like that. Hopefully Minecraft fixes that little glitch right there. But So this is what it's going to look like actually now. And then we're going to take our scion stained glass panes. We're just going to fill in all of these windows right here including the middle one this time. I know I just skipped over it. So let's get that one. So now that's what it's going to look like. Let's get some lanterns down here as well.
All right, that looks pretty good. I think it's well lit enough. So that's what it's gonna look like now. And now what we're going to do is we're going to take our spruce wooden slabs. We're going to build over this area right here. We're gonna build a, put a ceiling in. It's gonna extend out one on the sides. It's not going to extend out at all from or from the front or the back, yeah. Let's go ahead and get that other side right there. We're gonna extend this wall out three more blocks. All right, and now for the final part of the build right here, we're just gonna put down three more blocks right there. And then over here, we're gonna put down a little window. We can go ahead and fill it in with black stained glass panes. And then this part up here is supposed to be up just one more block. And put another window in right here as well. So there we go, that's what it will look like now. You can break that out too. And then we're just going to connect these two walls right there with the beam of white concrete. Let's put a lantern down right there and one in the other corner as well. And then on these side windows right here, these one by four windows, we can fill those in with scion stained glass panes. And now on this top row right here, what we're gonna do, let's go take a look at what it, so this is what the build will look like so far now. And now up here, what we're gonna do, so we're going to put down a layer, a block of white concrete right there, one right there. We're gonna go all the way down here, put another one. And then we can go ahead and do the same on this side as well. We're just gonna fill in in between those and then put our black stained glass panes in between all those. And then on top of all of that, we're going to put down a layer of our spruce wooden slabs and it's going to extend out by one layer. So let's have it extend out here. And then we can go ahead and fill that in once we've got the outline. All right, so that's what it's gonna look like. We can go on inside now and let's put down some lanterns on that top floor so it isn't so dark. I, I usually uh, like hiding the lanterns. Let's just place down two more blocks right there. I usually like hiding them behind the beams so that you can't really see them from the outside. So let's go back down. And that is the full house tutorial. I'm not going to decorate the interior at all just because I feel like that's more of a personal preference of what you want it to look like but we're not quite done with the build here yet now what we're going to do we're going to just put some outside decorations so I'm just going to dig out this area right here and this is going to be a two a double wide uh, black path and then I'm going to put some dead bubble coral block down and if uh, well you're probably not building this in survival if you were to build this in survival 
first of all that's like a pretty huge build uh, to follow um, but if you can't find any of this stuff then I just use uh, cobblestone because it looks almost exactly the same and then right here I'm just gonna put down some water I'll put down some water right here as well just have two little fountains two little uh, streams right there and then I can put down some water right here, the front. Then we'll put down some more over at this side to make it even. And there you have it guys, that is the full Modern Mansion tutorial that I have for you guys today. Uh, thank you to everybody who made it this far in the video and watched the entire thing. It really does mean a lot to me that you guys watch my videos. Um, I'm sure you guys noticed that there are some other houses in the background. If you enjoyed watching this tutorial and if you want to see more builds like it, then go ahead and check out those houses as well, because I have a lot of builds that are very similar to this. Um, and yeah, again, thank you everybody for watching. It does mean a lot to me. Uh, go ahead and hit subscribe if you haven't already, and hit the little bell button. And I hope to see you all in my next video. Peace.